So Mark's chopping in his Z900 for a Speed Triple RS today. So we're going to head down to Swindon and pick up the new bike. And here she is, the Speed Triple 1200 RS. loved his Z900 over three years and 20,000 miles and he wouldn't have wanted to spend that time on anything else. However it's time for a major service and new tyres so it seemed a good time to swap things out. Mark wanted better stopping power and suspension and while things were only ever adequate on the Z900, Mark fancied a little bit of extra power while he still has the reaction times and presence of mind to use them. He looked at the Z900SE and the MT09SP, but he's been there and done that with the Japanese brands, and I think he's looking for something a little bit different, and the Speed Triple RS scratches that itch. I really loved Blade Triumph at Stratford-upon-Avon, and it had this wall with Triumph through the years. There were loads of really nice Bonnevilles. My particular favorite was this T120 black, really stealth. And the retro look is really growing on me. Check out this RVF V4. Mark signing his life away and the machine being wheeled out of the dealership onto its loving new home. Now I asked Mark if he had any concerns about the Speed Triple and his main concerns are wondering if the bike is worth six and a half thousand more than the Z. Is it as reliable as a Jap bike? Is it possible to tour and commute on it with the comfort? And can the stiff suspension handle the Cotswolds? Another question is did we both get a speeding ticket on the way home? Only time will answer these questions. <laughs> <laughs> 